Hello everyone, welcome to another Google podcast. Today I'd like to show you how you can download a copy of all of your Google documents so that you have a backup. Now you might be wondering why I would recommend doing that as Google is well known for their data security and um, stability. Uh, it's known, it's very, very rare, um, very, very few occurrences that people actually lose data uh, permanently. One of the reasons I would recommend this is that is that there have been some instances where um, a Google account has been compromised, it's been hacked into, and people have uh, done inappropriate things in that account causing it to be temporarily dis disabled while uh, the owner of the account sorts out the issue with Google. During the time that that account is disabled, you would lose access to all of your Google documents. If you live in Google Docs like I do, I do pretty much all of my work within Google Docs, this would be significant inconvenience. Um, I have some very important documents for work that I rely on on a daily basis, and not having access to them in any form would um, be a significant problem. So I have begun to back up my documents on a semi-regular basis, and Google makes this very, very easy to do. You can see that I'm within Google Docs and I'm going to go ahead and click on a collection. This one that I'll use for an example is the EdReach Google Plus post. When you click on the collection you'll notice that a little arrow appears just to the right of the collection name. I'm going to click on that arrow which brings up additional options. I'm going to click on the one that says download. Clicking on the download button brings up this box which identifies all of the objects within that collection and asks what I would like to do with them. This collection here happens to just have three um, documents and so I have the option to download them as Microsoft Word, plain text, rich text, PDF, and various other formats. I can select what I would like and then simply click on the download, download link and it will zip those documents into a single folder which I can easily take and store on my computer or external hard drive. If you'd like to download all of your documents in a single click, simply click on the All Items tab up at the top, which will open up an additional um, dialog box. And after you select what format you would like your documents to be saved in, simply click on the Download link. You can download up to two gigabytes worth of data at one time, which is convenient because the current limit for Google Docs accounts is two gigabytes. Therefore, um, it's uh, unlikely that any user would go over that limit unless they had purchased additional space. Even though there is a 2 gigabyte limit, it does take a while to download. When I click on this button, it will attempt to calculate how long this process will take. And it does take uh, a little bit of time both for Google to put together the zip file and to actually download it. When I did this earlier in the week, it took about 10 or 15 minutes to zip the files together and then about 30 minutes to download all of my data. I have about uh, one and a half gigabytes worth of data in my Google Docs account. Conveniently, Google provides this email when ready option so that you can continue working within your Google Docs account while the files are being prepared for download. You'll get a link in your email which you can click on to download that file. That link is only good for a couple of days so it is important that you um, act on that and download those files um, fairly soon and then you can take that zipped file and store it somewhere on your computer or external hard drive for use in case of emergency. Hopefully that's a helpful tip. I'm John Sawash. Thanks for watching.